beautiful babes. How is everyone doing today? I am super hot. My AC is broken, so I'm dying. I had a cute little like lace bomber jacket on, but I, I could not wear it. It's too hot. So today's video is going to be an unboxing of my Boxy Lux for June 2020. So I'm convinced that BoxyCharm and the USPS have conspired against me because they both hate me. So, number one, like, I don't get sent my boxy charm till like, the last possible minute. People, like, everybody has basically unboxed theirs, and then they're just sending me a tracking number. And for the past, like, three months, one of my accounts, like, keeps getting returned to sender. And, like, I should have another um, boxy, Lux and boxy premium. And I looked up the shipping numbers, and they're... It says, like, you need to pick them up at the post office, but I never got any slip or anything. So, I think my post guy, like, hates me. <laughs> He's like, you're my busiest customer. I'm like, I'm sorry. He's like, no, you keep me busy. So, that means he hates me. So, I didn't, um, I just did, like, my foundation, eyes, and brows because I wanted this to be a try-on unboxing. I don't know what is in here. I, if I remembering correctly if I remember correctly the choice item was skincare but I did her I did her I did order um this hourglass uh, highlighting vanish flash highlighting stick from the pop-up shop and I'm hoping there are some other makeup items in here as well so if you are interested in seeing that then keep on watching and if you do like this video please let me know by giving it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave so I got this highlighting stick in champagne flash and it's crazy because I was honestly gonna buy it like full price on the Sephora website because I've always been wanting to try it and then I saw it in the pop-up shop and I was like awesome so let me just try a little of this All right, I'm going to take my beauty sponge and just blend that. And you can do this, like, underneath your foundation, too, if you don't want your highlight, like, as bright. But it'll still give it a really beautiful glow and, like, make any highlighter that you put on top of it, like, even more stunning. Okay, now let's get into this box. Oh, my gosh. I actually get an information card? I can't believe it. Okay, so the first product is... Oh, good. I really was wanting this. This is the Glow Recipe Avocado Melt Retinol Sleeping Mask. This Avocado Melt Retinol Sleeping Mask is a cream nourishing mask formulated with antioxidant rich avocado, exfoliating PHA, and the most gentle form of retinol, encapsulated retinol. Awesome. So this retails for $49. I have actually, I have a sample of the avocado like eye night mask, and it is so amazing. Oh my gosh. It feels so awesome going on the skin. So if this is anything like that, I'm going to be super pleased. I think pharmacy always has the cutest packaging. Oh my gosh, I hate avocado and it looks just like it, but as long as it doesn't smell like it, I'm good. No, it doesn't. Okay, I'm really excited about that. Alright, the next product is ooh, this Too Faced Cocoa contour palette. Yay! I also wanted this. So this is cocoa infused contouring and highlighting palette and so it has three highlights and three contour shades. Let's open her up. This retails for $44 and we are definitely going to be trying this baby on. Here is what it looks like. Ooh. I love this packaging. It's so bougie. I, I love it. Okay, so, oh, these are, these are like matte highlights. So these are going to be good for like brightening up your under eye. I'm going to go in with light highlight. Oh, and they smell like cocoa. I love it. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with Oh, yes, I do. I do, I do. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with light contour right here. It's a really nice, cool-toned color. And I think it works perfectly on my fair skin. 
Um, I don't know if I would ever use the other two. I mean, I could use them as eyeshadows. Because, like, you know those tubers who were like, oh, I have different foundation shades for in the winter. It's like, no, I'm just freaking pale-ass white the entire year round. I've just learned to embrace it. <laughs> So it's not like I can be like, oh, well, I can maybe one, use one of these shades when I'm darker, but th that doesn't happen. Oh my god, I'm sweating so bad. It's not, I mean, this is still blending out beautifully, but me being sweaty is not the most ideal situation to be putting makeup on. I really do like this palette, though. So, next we have this. Kat Von D Inkwell Longwear Matte Eyeliner. Okay, is it in black? Yes, it's trooper black. Um, I mean, it is. Oh, this is different than I was expecting. Okay, shake. It said shake it. All right, let me see what this says. Um, the most bulletproof matte eyeliner yet. Okay, retails for twenty dollars. Here is what it looks like. I do like me the like eyeliners that are in that kind of container. Oh, that looks good. Okay, I am definitely gonna try that. So next is what, what what's with all the Kat Von D products? Okay, this KVD Vegan Beauty Studded Kiss Cream Lipstick. So I've had a couple of these before, but it says introducing the new and reborn. And this is in Munetka, Nessa. I don't know if it's gonna be like that color. Let me see. Ooh, it's a really pretty like peach nude. Did I say how much does that retail for? $20 as well. <gasps> I'm gonna try this on. Ooh. I'm really liking that. Okay. All right, next we have this Baddington Beauty Powder and Contour Brush Set. Oh, I wish I would have seen that so I could have used it to try the contour shades on. So, $90? Mm-hmm. Ooh, they are really soft, though. Ooh, that would be a good blush brush. And that would definitely be a good, like, bronzer or contour brush. Let me try the contour shade again. Ooh, yeah, that's really nice. Then the last product is this... Skin & Co. Sardanian Spirit Shower Gel. Okay, um, with notes of Sardinian, Myrto, Lemongrass, and Wild Orange. 7.7 .7 ounces. This retails for $22. Let me see. Sardinian. That makes me think like sardines. Oh, it smells... okay. It smells very fresh, very florally, but like, kind of like nature floor? I don't know. Um, yeah, I, I'll probably put this in a giveaway because I've been using my soaps in my shower. <laughs> Alright, let's see what the total retail value for this boxy lux is. So the total retail value is $245. And overall, I am really pleased with this box. I'm super excited about the Glow Recipe Mask, um, the contour palette. I really like that lipstick. I'm excited to try the eyeliner. And the only thing I'm not like woohoo about is the body wash. But everything else, yeah, I'm super stoked for. Let me know what you guys got in your Boxy Charm or Boxy Lux and what do you think of the one I got? Because you guys know better than I do. <laughs> um, I don't watch any unboxings because I don't, I want to be surprised like completely when I get mine. Alright guys, I love you. I hope you enjoy this video and I will see you next time. Bye.